We went to Romania. Okay. So we have the basic A and Necronomicon. Okay. This game is particularly light on the items, by the way. I've noticed. Particularly light on the items, it's indeed. It's literal trash. You'll probably pick it up. Maybe I will. Oh, I'm convinced you will. Okay, I'm picking it up. Good. Great. <laughs> okay, well... Look, I am picking it up. That's just swell, buddy. You better believe it. I do. Fine. Good. Okay. Wow, you picked up the guy. Wait, what? Really? It's, uh... I mostly picked it up to spite Kitty. Oh, wow. Actually, we picked up the garbage? Holy shit. Okay, well... It's where the mayor of Forumari toils away, serving the citizens. Mayor of Forumari? Eh? I'll just leave them to it. Forumari! That sounds Italian. Who the fuck is this? A man in what I think is a traditional mask. He looks really distressed as far as I can tell. Uh -huh. Best not involve her unless absolute. Uh, good evening? The castle must make it to the castle. Castle? What? Must reach castle. Must defend castle. Who the fuck? I'm afraid I can't help you with that, sir. What castle? What? What castle? Who? It's a cable running from that inn to the reddish gate. Probably internet, I'm thinking. Internet? Wait, what? Who? Wait, what? We're both following this cable, right, Kide? Hmm. Good time, Kido, there. Yeah, a conspicuous ornate gate with an intense red glow emanating from behind it. Hmm. Did you swallow a thesaurus while I was asleep? Pray remain unobtrusive, feline. <laughs> Pray remain unobtrusive. Oh! Stop right there, little chicklet. What's your business with the Corvins? Uh, are you talking to me, ma'am? Why, yes. Yes, I am, sweetheart. You are trying that door over there, and it's for me to decide who goes or doesn't go through it. Through it! <laughs> I tend to go into the fellow for and I don't follow that cable there. I just got really curious. Such an interesting door. Why yes! Yes it is very interesting. <laughs> what business have you with the Corvins? Okay, I lied. I just need to go in to follow that cable there. I'm trying to restore the internet and GPS to the place, you know, doing some good. Oh, so you're with the people that come fiddle with the cables every once in a while? Exactly. Well, they all know the answer. So tell me this. How many pieces did Corvin's heart break into? The fuck? Three hundred and eighty-six. Who's the COVID guy you've been you keep mentioning? I have no idea what, what, what you're about. Yeah, actually, indeed. Who's this Corbin guy you keep mentioning? Don't play dumb with me, Chicklet. Shoo now, shoo! I'm not really sure I understand what's going on here. You can't grasp the concept of password protected entry? Don't they have internet where you came from, Chicklet? Oh, the dude is just really, really slow. <laughs> Do you realize I'm male, right? I seem to have forgotten my password. <laughs> my password. I seem to have forgotten my password. Any suggestions on how to proceed? There's always the password recovery system, Chicklet. Oh, cool. How do I access that? Ah, Lord knows where he is right now. It's a he? Yes, that's my husband. He won. He could be anywhere right now, but he's probably hanging around the inn, like always. Uh -huh. how do I recognize, how do I recognize your husband? Why can't the password recovery? Why can't you be password recovery system? 
Can I go now? Actually, yeah, why? Why can't you be the password recovery system? Does your wife do everything around the house <laughs> while you just uh, lie around? I don't have a wife. Doesn't surprise me. Hey. Hey. How do I recognize your husband? Big silly black hat and bigger and sillier white mustache. Thanks. Okay, can I go now? Can I go in now? As soon as you tell me the number of pieces Corvin's heart broke into. Okay. I'll get back to you on that. <laughs> okay. Oh, wow, dude. Wait, before we go there, I want to see something. I actually want to check out this place over here before we do that. This is a inn, right? Yeah. What a quaint little horse-drawn carriage. I can't drive this. Coach... Oops. I can't drive this. Coachman has to be around, though. Kid A, be nice to the horse. <laughs> what? Did I say or do anything? Just being preemptive, that's all. Jeez. <laughs> be nice to the horse. Good okay. to know there's a functioning vehicle around here. That's a good horse. <laughs> I can't drive coach. What? Gee. Badly lit street. It's a particularly badly lit street, probably leading outside of town. Not without the protection of some kind of vehicle. Ah, that's why I went in the carriage, right? Okay. We are going in the inn then, boy. What a lovely place. Just stay alert. I can smell the tension in the air. That's probably just customers waiting for their meals to arrive. It takes time to dice up the meat enough to hide the stab wounds. <sighs> okay. All right. Oh, this is the internet, eh? Hmm. Self-involved gentleman. Ah, so this is the guy. Yeah, this is the husband. Innkeepers, innkeepers. All right. I'll bet that guy spends hours in the mirror daily. <laughs> I think she'd better lay low in here. Evening. Yeah, hello. Do I know you? Please go away. My name is Buzz. I'm a tourist. My name's Buzz, and uh, I'm a tourist. My name is Vasile, and I'm the alpha male. I'm not bragging. I don't want it to sound confrontational. Just putting it out there so it's crystal clear. Okay, Vasile. I can respect that, I think. Hmm. So, what's up? Look, man, I'm kind of busy trying to get the waitress's attention. Would you mind bothering someone else? Sheesh, fine. Wait a minute. Maybe you could help. Really? How? Come stand next to me. That way, I'll shine even more by contrast, you know? Thanks. I'll pass. Hmm. Have you seen a girl called Peace around? Not since I've been sitting here. And you can trust me. If there's anything I would have noticed, it would be a girl. Is she pretty? Never mind. Dude, we don't we don't even know how she looks, bro. Nice beard. Of course it's nice. It's only seen the inside of the best rated beard salons in the country. You have beard salons in Transylvania. Oh, cause we're Transylvanians and we should just let our facial hair grow out like animals, right? Bigot. Hey, I'm a <laughs> Bigot. Too. With that sad excuse of a five o'clock shadow. Please. Oh, brother. Uh, yes. So, this waitress... Anna. Anna. How do you plan on getting her attention? 
other than my stunningly styled hair, impeccably waxed beard and rock hard abs? Uh, I think that's as far as this plan goes. <laughs> that's it? Well, your interests are completely opposite, or, or your characters don't match. Wait, what do you mean? We both look good. Are you interested in anything other than her looks? Uh, I, uh, I <laughs> don't think I understand your question. <laughs> Never mind, dude. See you around. Okay. Okay. Vinegar. Looks like a vial of vinegar. Hmm. Watch out! What? What? You just said watch out. I did? Oh, I did. What? <laughs> oh. oh. Watch out! <laughs> that there is not vinegar. It's not. What? No. It's a powerful solvent. I, uh, uh, I mislabeled it. <laughs> Silly me. Nearly killed myself with it. Not to mention me. Can I still have it? What? Yes, yes, take it. Just don't put it in your salad. What? What? Oh, darn it, now I'm doing it too. Uh, faint. Okay. Okay, yeah, we got the vinegar, all right. It's a fork with very bent tines. Okay. I mean, who knows? It might come in handy. I mean, dude, you, dude, you took garbage out of the out of the garbage bin. You better take that shit. This guy's really enjoying his food. Well, yeah. Hi there. Huh? What? What? Hey, eh, my name is Buzz. How do you find this? My name is Buzz. I'm happy for you, son. What? What? Okay. Hmm. Uh, nothing. All right then. What? Hey, what? So. Yes, what? Hmm. Where was I? How should I know, son? What? Uh, never mind. How do you like this end? It's pretty good, considering it's the only one. That makes sense. I'm here about the password recovery. What? What's that? I forgot my username and password. You what? Uh, I mean, I, I forgot my password. Oh, all right. Well, do you have the letter? 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 What letter? The Y. What? What? No, no I'm afraid I don't. Come back when you have it, Sonny. Letter? What? The the what? water. No. Come back with. Okay, so we're going to need a letter to find or something. What? All right then. Okay. All right. I think they're the owners of this fine establishment. Hi. Hello, foreigner. Foreigner. Greetings, stranger. Greetings. My name's Kerwin. Buzz Kerwin. Rodika. Rodika. And this is my husband, Istvan. Istvan. Wait. Did you say Carwan? Yes, I'm actually half Romanian myself. Tu lai doamne, ești? I'm thinking. Yes, dear, and I don't like it one bit. What? Nothing. Never mind. Oh, why does everything have to be so mysterious and complicated? I never forget. What's uh, about my name? What was that about my name? Oh, it's just. Uh, how do you spell that? K-E-R-W-A-N See? That doesn't sound like a local name. Not at all. Has it been altered in the last few generations? You know, I really have no idea. Wait, altered from, from what? Istvan, let it go. It's the gentleman's business. What but the fuck? Shush. Cool, <laughs> what? Enjoy your stay in scenic Transylvania, my friend. Hmm. I'm looking for a girl. This is not that kind of thing. No, no, a particular <laughs> girl. Her name is Peace. 
Is this some kind of uh, social commentary metaphor you're trying to pull? Pretty beautiful if it is. Uh, no, I mean it in the most literal way. Look, we have to be very skeptical to strangers around here. Especially foreigners. Don't ask, we just do. Okay. Foreign stranger, no one ever seems to be welcoming anymore. Foreigner, stranger, no one ever seems to be welcoming anymore. I'm starting to think it's me. Oh, it's uh, not you. We have to. Istvan, you should stop talking now. Now we're more curious. No, no, by all means, you know. No, no, by all means, keep talking. You have a what? A very wise wife. Who reminds me when I'm talking out of school. Oh, Isti, you smooth operator. Smooth <laughs> operator. I'm still curious about the welcome attitude. I'm still curious about your unwelcoming attitude. I mean, this is an inn, right? We are, um, we have to be skeptical toward foreigners. Have to? And I'm half Transylvanian. Half Transylvanian, huh? Okay, okay. Let's say you need to earn our trust. Here then. Okay, how do I go about earning your trust then? That sounds really simple, sorry for being blunt. <laughs> okay, well. How would one go about earning your trust then? Chuika! Hmm. Gesund hide. You said you're half Transylvania. Suica is our local drink. 60% alcohol. 60? Holy and fuck. you expect me to ingest that? I can't trust a man unless he drinks with me. What century is this again? It's our tradition. So, we drink? Holy fuck. Hit me. <laughs> Hit me. <laughs> no, no. Wait, did... Did he, did he throw it away? Go. Now ask me anything. <laughs> Wait, did he throw the glass away? I don't understand. Come back when you're sober, eh? <laughs> that was lame. Hit me. No, no. Ah no, he drank it, he, but he threw away the glass. There you go. No. <laughs> Could have had the firewall. I don't understand. Come back when. So what happens if I do the, the third one? No. no. <laughs> there you go. I don't understand. Ah, okay, so it's the same thing. All right, all right. All right. Talk to you guys later. Servus. Servus. Okay, all right. So, either way, we go out of here, right? We have some solvent. Oh, what the fuck is this? Voluminous gentleman. A quite voluminous guy, unlit pipe in his mouth. What the fuck it means? What if I'm voluminous? Voluminous? What? Voluminous. Voluminous. Very loose or full, having much fabric. Very lengthy and detailed. I see. Thicker volumes of the volumes of hair. Hmm, interesting. Voluminous. Okay. Hey, 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 hey. Greetings, my skinny friend. Hey, hey, hey. Oh my, hey there. Good to meet someone friendly. <laughs> Have you been talking to these grams around here? Uh, don't judge them too harshly. That's standard foreigner procedure. Standard procedure? This must be a cultural barrier thing. I'm baffled. I am afraid it's not for me to explain. So, let's just leave it at that. So, 
What is it you wanted to talk to me about, Sonny? Actually, nothing particular. Just the... Uh, just the... Uh, let's pipe! <laughs> My name's Buzz. Buzz Kerwin. Luca, the coachman. Ah! Service. Oh, he's a coachman. How's the coach business going, Luca? It really depends on where you want to go. It's been several days now that we have no GPS signal. Strange times indeed. You need GPS for your coach? Well, again, it depends on where you want to go. Some places are very difficult to access, even to an experimented couchman like Experiment. me. So Experiment. me and Rosie had Rosie. to relay on technology. You know? But everything mm. is so traditional around here. Ah, uh, don't let appearances fool you. We have some of the fastest internet in the world, friend. It Damn. just sort of went away locally, along with the GPS signal. Just went away? Just went away? You didn't look into it? Everyone who was good at computers moved away years ago, sadly. Tech support should be on its way. Unfortunately, with no GPS and the treacherous terrain, plus this weather, who knows when they arrive? Hmm. What if I told you I'm tech support? Well, uh, you'd make Luca a very happy man. See, my love life. <sighs> yes? <sighs> Why am I about to pour my heart out to a stranger? Because you're not because I'm incredibly well versed in minds of the heart. <laughs> because... Let's say that. Because I'm incredibly well versed in matters of the heart. Oh, look, my friend. See that beautiful waitress over there. Her name's Anna. The prettiest name in the world. Just listen to it. Anna. Anna. Luca is so in love with her. Uh, sorry, but what does this have to do with the GPS and internet being down? Well, this isn't the Middle Ages. Buzz, I can't just walk up and talk to her like some troglodyte. Oh, <laughs> she can't? She, she can't see up. <laughs> no, no, no. Of course not. Not in this digital day and age. Oh, I can't rest until I see which way she swipes for me on garlic. Is that some kind of dating app? The <laughs> best there is in Transylvania. Oh, he was. Oh, wow, dude. What if she's just not into you? What are you doing there, Luca? What if she's just not into you? Oh, Luca will just look for another girl. I guess. But I need to know first. Can't make any moves before that. Huh, that's a very mature way to see things. Nice. Eh. <sighs> Life is too short to cry over spilled milk, friend. <laughs> very wise, very wise, Luca. Plenty of pretty girls in Transylvania. Don't you worry about that. I just hope she doesn't fall for that hipster Vasile. With his trimmed beard and his fancy haircut. Huh? What if I go and ask for you? What are you doing? Yeah, indeed. What if I go ask her for you? What is this? Fourth grade in the 18th century? True. Huh. I'd be left out of the inn. <sighs> what are you eating there, Luca? What are you eating there, Luca? Oh, 
just had my mamaliga, but I'm afraid it's all gone. Do you think I could have the little cauldron? Uh, I'll bring it back. Well, uh, sure. As long as Rodica doesn't notice. Help yourself. This is what I don't like. This is exactly what I don't like about this game. All the items that you take are very telegraphed, dude. The, this, this game is very, very simplistic about the, its item usage. For example, in any other game, I would have to pass the mouse over the the ball, whatever that was, and see if I can take it, right? Now he just did it by himself. There was no service whatsoever. There's, I don't know. This is the only thing I don't like about the simplicity of the puzzles, I guess, as far as the items are concerned. It's way, it's way too simple, I think. Luca, help me out with this Tsuika thing. No, 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 thank you. Got to keep a clear head when steering the couch. <laughs> okay, well, all right. Do you have any idea what I could do so it doesn't hit me like a freight train? Um, I remember reading about that on a forum recently. But my memory isn't what it used to be. If only the internet was working. Oh, so that's why I have to fix the internet. Oh, I see. Nice pipe. Nice pipe. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> All right, bro. Tell you the truth. Oh, wow. Okay. I haven't smoked in 24 years, but I feel it gives me some facial balance. Okay. Ah, it's a, it's a style thing then. All right, boy. See you later, Luca. Talk to you soon, Buzz. Okay, so we have garbage, we have the solvent, a bent fork, and the cauldron. Like what? That would just not make more trash. Wow, okay. Wouldn't affect it. This thing is heavy metal. Oh, that's a solvent, true. Okay, well, there is more there is more of an area to go, so let's go and check that out before we do anything else. There is uh, the area back there with uh, with the kiddies, with the kiddos. Let's go. All right, so I haven't been here, so I don't know what that place is. Seems like Don Imagos, artist, creator, director, actor, visionary, modern day Viking. Holy brought shit. important contributions to the art of indie game making to Transylvania from the distant lands of the New World. In the game, oh. He was a game designer? Thank you for your contributions in the field of indie game making, Don Imagos. We salute you. Yeah, thanks, buddy. <laughs> thanks, buddy. Art critic. This lady is really interested in that mural up there. Oh, it's a mural, yeah. Hi there. I couldn't help but notice you're examining that mural up there. Pardon me? Oh, yes, indeed I am, yes. Can you tell me anything about it? Why, of course. You see, there is a certain ambiguity in regard to the vivacious and decidedly histrionic undertones of the disjunctive perturbation present within the artist's essentially transitional brushwork. Wouldn't you say? Oh, yes, abso uh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, you must not let this hint of over-specificity on my part overshadow the obviously resonant spatial relationships Obvious. between the reductive quality of the lines and the commitment to a rigorously formal approach on the artist's behalf. Actually, what you must understand is that the work echoes its own <laughs> edges with its obsequious interior dialogue Very and even replicates yeah, yeah. itself, paradoxically denying any allusion to a juxtaposed mythopoetical reality. Wow, dude. Yeah, but what does that all, what does all that mean? What can you tell me about this bastard? What do you think of this cauldron? I have this pocket full of trash. <laughs> what do you think of this solvent? 
Yeah, but what does it all mean? Aren't you paying attention, young man? It signifies that the structuralist paradigm under which the creator did Oh my god, are you serious? Flush with interpolated post dialectic musings that cannot be rightfully ignored. That's oversimplifying it a bit, but yeah, okay. <laughs> oversimplifying a bit. What is the significance of the divided heart? What is the significance of the divided heart? It is clearly a corollary of the coronary metaphors which permeate the opacity and quintessential divergence of pervasive aesthetic hierarchies in the artist's oeuvre. Uh, I agree. <laughs> or the artist's oeuvre. What can you tell me about this bus ticket? An incisive voyagerial metaphor, rectangularly encased in an obviously sarcastic homage to utter futility and cavalcading materialism. Oh wow, dude, seriously? The old art form of busting it? What do you think of this cauldron? An unrelentingly piercing allusion to corporeal gastronomic enslavement. In the almost puritanical form of a hemisphere, wrought of sacrosanct hunger, both telluric and spiritual. You nailed it on the head. Holy fuck. I have this pocket full of trash. Ah, ah, such a puckish postmodernist cliche turned anti cliche, or as some would put it, mud for reversed boilerplate. Not an entire. Jesus Christ! Coming from a distinguishably inexperienced dabbler in the arts, but one I uncontemptuously applaud nonetheless. Bitch! Yeah, it's, it's trash! Yeah. It's just trash, really. <laughs> Precisely. Wink wink, as they say. No, 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 there's no wink wink, it's literally like trash. I just picked that shit out of the trash can. What do you think of this solvent? What do you think of this solvent? Are you by any chance employing Tarekia's earthly chemistry as a means of subsuming the, uh, the inextricable anthropologic dissolution into a pan-expressive mechanistic <laughs> allegory of human suffering what? and decay? I sure am. Virgin. <laughs> Virgin. Uh, your critique. Okay, yeah. I'll leave you to your critique. Indeed, indeed. Wow, I, that we, we literally learned nothing. I think it's this kid's slingshot just lying in the grass. That's a cool slingshot you got there, kid. Yes, isn't it crazy that I know about more than just computer screens and video games? Mind blowing. I know. Oh, come on. Mind if I take a look at it? Yeah, because I'm just giving my deadly slingshot away to a stranger. Sure. Isn't the cooler and more realistic than a video game? Nothing looks. Isn't it cooler and more realistic than a video game? I don't know, but it can realistically take your eye out. So, which of these two is worse? You tell me. Well, if you put it that way. I made it way too deadly. The world's not ready for it. Right. <laughs> that thing does not look deadly. It's only made from the toughest wood you'll find around these parts and a virtually unbreakable rubber band. And I've used industrial grade glue to put the thing together. Not only is it deadly, it's indestructible. Damn, bro. Okay, okay, I believe you. I, I, I can take that thing apart, is it? <laughs> I'll bet I can take it apart. Easy. <laughs> really, dude? You're on. What are we wagering? Just the satisfaction of being right and in the other guy's face, kid. <laughs> okay, then. It's on. It was that simple? Really? It was that fucking so, simple? So, what are you playing? Call of Beauty 6. I thought shooters sucked on mobile. Call of Beauty. <laughs> Call of Beauty is not a first-person shooter. It's a survival game. Survival game? Really? Yeah, really. You role-play this supermodel, and every once in a while, you have to survive on no food before a show. Like <laughs> Holy shit. Days. That's terrible. Games have changed since your days, old man. Everything is realistic now. Disturbingly so. 
Nice place, this town. Nothing ever happens here, and I can't even get data on my phone anymore. But yeah, great place. Well, if you looked up from that screen every once in a while, you'd see that it is. Oh, jeez, you're one of those, aren't you? Yeah, I know, right? You get it. You grew up hitting a ball against the wall, not glued to the screen. <laughs> you were so much better off. True. Thanks for the insight. Bye. Well, uh, no, nobody cared, bro. Meant. I was a nerd just like you. Oh yeah, you're totally hip to geek them and down <laughs> with the youth pups. <laughs> Jesus Christ, bro! You are a geek in the in the library. What are you talking about? It sounds like you are 70 years old, man. Holy shit! You were a nerd. You still are, you little shit. Have you seen a girl called Peace Around? Have you seen a girl called Peace Around? No, I haven't. Cause I'm one of those losers who won't look up from their screens at the real world. <laughs> right? <sighs> I mean, the kid is clever though. You got fucked. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Why he would give us a slingshot though? Just because we bet him that we could break it? What if we just took it without doing shit though and never giving it back oh man what a neat looking balcony i'd love to have one just like that really um it's not mine to use so i'd love it to be okay well tourist into oh did you point oh wow oh no not thankfully this one seems to be abandoned oh I've had enough tourist information stuff for a while. I won't. Well, the other guy was quite interesting though, and quite fun to be honest. A single solitary lit window. Who's in there, and why? Why am I even asking these questions? Because the house still looks like to be a bad and shit, and there is only one window open. Nah, let's just leave whoever that is alone. True, man. True. No reason. You don't wanna fuck with that place. Looks abandoned as fuck. Okay, so apparently we need to. Yeah, so we have a slingshot, right? So. Wait, can I use the? Can I use the the slingshot with the with the with the window? Wait, yo, go in there. Go go in there, little shit. Okay, so can I use the slingshot with the window? No way, dude. That's flippin' rude. Don't, hey, you got your mouth. You always you say flipping. <laughs> what kind of language is this? Okay. Alright, so... Wait, um, wait a minute. City Hall, City Hall... Um, so, I need... In order to get the password, I need some... I need the... the le some kind of letter, I think it was? Um, wait, so let me see here. So, if I do... He doesn't need... He does... He doesn't need any of that shit, right? He doesn't... What? Not a great way to make a. F True. Wait, wait. What if I gave the the garbage to the horse? Does he the, the <laughs> No way. Horsey is nice. Horsey. True, dude. Don't feed garbage to the horsey, bro. Oh, tourist info. Wait. <laughs> it's a tourist info thing about the statue and town in general. Yeah. Yep. Just as I suspected. It's a Vlad. Oh wow! Really? It's a tourist info. Th uh huh. Wait, what? Is she out because she, because his name was Vlad? Eh? Um, inside. Where is it? Oh, there it is. It's nice and useful. That's most definitely a sign saying in something. Right. Okay. So, um, what if I wait? Jeez, no. I like this horsey. <laughs> hey! No, okay. no. No way. Horse is a nice horse, the solvent. Oh, no way. 
Okay, bitch! Okay. Alright, let's go in. What if I threw some solvent in the pot, bro? Would that actually help? Don't think so, eh? That would just make more trash. How? I mean, if you put the solvent on the, in the trash, how would that make more trash? Well, never mind. Um. Oh, radio. Hey, it's an old-timey radio. Charming. Ah. Oh, welcome back, listeners from Transylvania and indeed the whole of Romania. That was, um, let me see here. Hm. Oh, well, apparently I have no idea who was thinking that, but, uh, oh boy, what a thinker. Maybe we're better off not ever knowing, right? Right, well, never mind. Right. No, that's the exception right here on Garlic Radio, because we only play the top Transylvanian hits. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> your boy, wait, no, it's your main man, Yanku, and we'll be spending the next hour or so together, so buckle up, everybody! <laughs> buckle up! Whether you are in an autonomous or animal traction vehicle, wear the seatbelt. Please, they don't put those potholes in the rope for nothing, you know what I'm saying? Ah, 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 ah. Ooh, I crack myself up sometimes. Anyway, dear listeners, here's a weather update. We have no idea what's happening anymore. Ah, uh, yeah, they have no internet, eh? Weather. What is this? Some kind of a joke? And what's this hurricane? Herbie, or whatever they call it, doing here? Hurricanes? In my Transylvania? And not only that, apparently it's messing with the GPS and internet in certain areas. I'm told the Forum Maris is affected by this. Well, Forum Marishans, I hope you're receiving this. You should at least have a garlic radio in your life. Am I right? Sure, I'm right. All righty. Well, well. Caller, you're on the air. You're on the air. Yanko? Yes, you're on the air. How long does this go on, dude? Is it really Yanko? Yes, it's a me. <laughs> oh, wow, does this go on forever? This always gets me. You call the radio specifically to talk to me, and then you're so surprised when you finally do, and you don't believe it's me. So many people doing that. I don't get it. It's like, um, it's like if I call the police. <laughs> surprised is the police and, and question it. True, though. I'm just a little jumpy today. Just feeling this crazy times we're living in a bit more intensely. Must be this weird mood swings the weather's been having. <sighs> All right. What's your name and what are you calling about? There's a team. You know there's a team, right? Yes, yes, absolutely. That's why I call. I'm John. Everyone calls me Johnny. I'm a... John? I used to work the wolves up the old road leading to Castle Negro. Work the wolves? What is that? Some kind of a crazy young man lingo like sweet or ghost riding the way for things keep saying nowadays? No, 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 no. I, I was working with actual wolves, you know. We'd have these wolves that would just run along the carriage and howl as tourists were transported to the castle. And then, and then we can't do it anymore. Well, my dear, it's not that I don't respect your profession, but wild animals should be left to be wild. Surely not you, as tourist attractions. No, but you don't understand. I wasn't hurting the animals or making them do it. We grew up together. Uh-huh. Granted, you don't sound like the most polite and serious Around anymore? Uh, no. 
ugly, ugly chopping accident. He really got carried away with a promotion and um kind of lost his head. Whoops. Oh, that's a shame. So sorry to hear that. You are so disworthsome. Yeah, me and my siblings each got one. Wait, you said wolves at first. Not wolf. What? Did you move in on your siblings' pets or something? No, see? They, uh, my siblings, uh, they kind of started dropping like flies. What, really? Forgive me for sounding insensitive, but your family seems... <laughs> really, really fragile. Yeah, well, I guess we have a tendency to stick our noses where we don't belong and then... Whoops! Oh. gone, so to speak. Yes. So I had these wolves and almost no close relatives to speak of, right? Well, we took a job as uh, security guards first. You and the wolves? Together? Well, yes, they let us work together because, you know, security. Makes so sense. These are really tame wolves. Like dogs, really. I get it, I get it. So, <laughs> was this like a wolf? Okay, it's interesting. No, a wolf. You were guarding a wolf? Pretty much, yeah. See, there were things on the other side of the wall. Things? And I kind of let them all come in. Oh, wow. Oh. So, so I was unemployed, so we got this gig running the walls along the carriages headed to the castle. And then that one we lost too. And you know why? No idea. Another wall? No. Tourists complaining. Too dangerous. One, these are tame wolves. Friendly. All they do is howl. Two, they do not want fear and excitement because that's our brand. I just don't get it anymore. I feel for you, Johnny. Yeah, they're making me use huskies. Huskies. How can I look my wolves in the eye anymore? <laughs> I don't know what to say, brother. Anyway, gotta go. Apparently, there's going to be this meeting and I have to be there. There's this new kid I'm supposed to show the ropes to. Well, that's nice of me. What's his name so we can give him a shout out? Um, uh, I think it's Ollie? Alright, Ollie and Johnny. Hope you guys get along. Good luck with the wolves and the cats and the wall and everything. Thanks, Yanku. Coming! Oh, wow! That was a... Um, surreal call. I think I can say that. Not quite. I mean, let's say on the edge of believability. <laughs> we wish you good luck, Johnny. It seems you and your family have been built a pretty bad car in life. Aye, what are you gonna do, right? Sometimes you're the snake, sometimes you're the vampire. Who knows? Maybe one day you'll make something of yourself. And take care of those wolves, will you? Good luck to you, kids. All right, then. Where was Wow, you? dude, how long does it go on? To check in with the nation, feel its pulse and vibration on the one and only. Hello? On the one and only. Garlic station? That's it, dear listener. Oh, we were almost getting far enough from my initial gap before the rain had to work anymore. But then you turned it around like a horse cart in love. Like a horse cart. <laughs> I sure did, didn't I? Yes, you did, dear listener. And my screen over here says your name is Mishu, right? Uh, well, it's me, hi, really. And frankly, I'm a little upset your producer would take such liberty with people's names like that. Oh, oh come on, we are all friends here, Mishu. Me, hi. Yes, whatever. So, you are aware that there's a team, right? Uh, really? Well, I, uh, don't know if I'll stick with it. I think I'll just wing it, you know? That's my motto in life, too, Annie. Michel How long does it go, bro? L, L, as the kids say, right, dear? So, was there something you felt you needed to communicate to the Garlic Nation? Yes, I love you, Mariwara. Oh, brother. Should've known. Should've known. Are you at least sure she's listening, friend? Who cares? The world must know. All right. Well, now that we got that out of the way, anything else, Michu? 
Yeah, at least. I suspect it was designed to do best is get caught in machinery and <laughs> in your day. Your oh, I remember that and shit, yeah. Not just your day, your, your life. <laughs> because now we can tell you about Motel Bonnet in the Carpathians because we have no more audio because we use so, dear foreigners complaining about how we're not authentic anymore here in Transylvania, good luck finding your motel in the Carpathian. Because I don't have the means to let you know what it's whereabouts are. And they are probably going to work their money. And can I blame them? Well, I could, but uh, that would be kind of unfair, don't you think? Well, you know what else is modern and out of place and unauthentic in Transylvania? Radio! Radio! Right. Goodbye and good riddance! Oh, it's over? Oh, wow, it's over! Oh, damn! We actually. Oh, wait, what? Wait, what? Was, um, let me see here. He's back? Oh, well, apparently I have no idea who was thinking that, but, uh, oh boy, what a stinker. Wait, no. Better off not ever knowing, right? No, that, that's a repeat. Well, wait, 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 wait. You know that the exception right here on Garlic Radio, because we only play the top... Yeah, that's, that, that, that's a repeat. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, it's your boy. Wait, no. Yeah. Your okay. Main menu. Okay. Wow, that was interesting though. That was qu quite way longer than I thought it would be. Damn, I'm impressed. I am actually impressed of how much dialogue this had. Holy crap, that was quite an effort there. These guys really love their pictures. Nicely decorated too. I don't think I need any pictures right now. Okay. East van Rodica. Hello. Dika. Hello. Dika. He's good in the dishes department. Ah. Hey, I'll bring this back, honest. Okay. Look, I'll bring it back. Doesn't solve anything. True. Dude, no, come on, that that's rude. <laughs> Did you go into some trash? No way. Uh, Did you go into some trash? Jeez, the man's eating. What am I thinking? <laughs> hey, dude, do you go into oh, trash? On, that, that would just be mean. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> the fuck. Okay, wait. Can I hit him in the head with a slingshot? Whoa, no, that that's rude. Can I stab his beard with a fork? Nah, I'm good. No? Maybe dissolve his beard? Oh, I think he's good on the chemicals part. Look at that main God shine. God damn. <laughs> hey, never hey, buddy. Hey, do you go in some trash? Wait, I like him. Do you go in the fork? He's covered as far as Cutler is concerned. True, bro. True. Do you want that sleeve in the oh, face? Man, that's rude. Eh, that's lame. <laughs> That's lame as fuck. <laughs> That's lame as fuck. God damn you. How are you, Nerfer? Everything alright, buddy? How are you doing, bro? God damn, it's cold, by the way. Okay. Do you want a bus ticket? This guy drives his own vehicle. I'm willing to bet. Yeah. Yeah, you never know though if you drive a vehicle. Doesn't look like a bus driver to me. 
True. Ah, uh, we didn't have are you? Yeah, everything is nice, my dude. Everything is nice indeed. Um, I'm in a, I'm in a search for a new keyboard, to be honest, for a new keyboard and mouse. I was thinking I am between uh, the death, the um, Black Widow, Razer Black Widow, and the new the and the other new keyboard they have. Um, and the Razer Naga for the AMOs and shit. I'm just not. I, I just don't know if uh, if the mechanical sound of the keyboard will be too high for uh, for the streamer shit, right? I don't know. Uh, I don't know yet. But I mean, uh, I, I am. I am searching. Okay. Way too big to be a projectile. True, bro. True. That would just make more trash. What if I threw that fork? No forking necessary. Yeah, that's true, eh? Oh, bro! That dissolved it. Ha! Huh, in your face, kid. Man, that stuff was powerful. Holy fuck, that dissolving thing, holy shit. Oh, the Y, bro. I've got the letter. All right, you'll need the illuminator. What? What's an illuminator? Thingamajig, makes light. What? You know what to do with it, right? Not really, no. Not really, no. Illuminator goes first. Then you add the letter and start counting. What? Could you be a little more specific? The old Corvinus heart. Light that sucker up. Then add the letter. Then start counting. What? All clear now? I guess. The old Corvinus. So. Yes, what? Hmm, where was I? How should I know, son? What? Uh, never mind. The old Corvinus heart light on fire a and... more specific. The old Corvinus heart. Light sucker up and light then add the letter. Up. Then add the letter. The then start counting. The old Corvinus what? heart. All clear now. I guess. In the sense that it's a it's a corvus heart from from from, from a corv from a cor cor from a bird the bird bird, bird heart. Uh, what, 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 what is that? What is that? What is the corvinus? What's a what's a what is a rubber band? Wait a minute. Oh, I just oh that's a helmet, bro. Got myself a cute little makeshift helmet. Holy shit! I'm just making this at this point, bro. I want to keep it as it is. Yeah, yeah, no shit. What about this garbage, though? That would Why do we have garbage? That would can I can I wear it? Let it not be said that the art of armor crafting is dead. Behold the cute little helmet of doom. I rolled my eyes so hard I almost saw my brain for a second. <laughs> Uh, true, bro. True. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Even though you could say that would be considered as armor crafting, eh? We made a helmet, bro. Can I use a helmet on this guy? No, and it wouldn't fit either way. Well, oh, yeah, he's a big head, eh? Um, wait. So, wait, 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 what? He said. Could you be a little? The old Corvinus heart. Light that sucker up. Then add the letter. Then start counting. What? All clear now? I guess. What the fuck is a Corvinus heart, bro? Bye. What? What? Buy my balls. My balls. My balls. Evening. Oh, it's you again. <laughs> what is it? Ah, uh, okay. So he doesn't know shit. 
He doesn't know shit. The old Corvinus heart. What the fuck is a Corvinus heart, bro? Um, wait, do I go and uh, tell the kid about how I fucked his his slingshot? Do I do I go and glow to the kid about how I ruined his uh, his uh, slingshot with a dissolvent and literally melted the shit out of it? Do, do I do I do I do I do I show him? Do I show him? Hey, what do you know? An ex slingshot. You must have cheated or something. Just admit defeat, Junior. Fine, who cares? I was bored of that thing anyways. So, can I keep the parts? Whatever. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm going there, bro. Yeah. Actually, a new place to go. I had no idea. What the fuck is this, bro? What the fuck? Gorgeous pastures. What the hell? It's the city's ancient walls. You can almost feel hundreds of years of history um, leaking from them. I'm not good at this. Emanating, bro. Emanating, you little shit. Learn your vocabulary. Neural, what the fuck is this? An intricate monochrome mural in stark contrast with the intense colors all around it. Wow. It seems to tell a pretty convoluted story. Wow, dude. So, big fires and doom and gloom and a dude choking a dragon and shit. Choking a dragon and shit. Oh, who the fuck is this? A senior citizen enjoying his time on that bench. Imagine being the senior citizen and ha having a guy sitting on your face and talking to himself about you. How awkward would that be? Uh, good evening. A good evening to you, young man. I see. Celebrate town for mice. Boy, what a sign, huh? Such a pretty town for Maris. Yes. And an old and storied one, too. Oh, if these walls could speak. The birds, the deaths, the wars. Yep. Maybe it's better that they can't speak. Hmm. Boy, what a sight, huh? Yes, yes, it is superb. The rolling hills with their scents of hay and white flowers. The gently grazing herds. Sometimes I wish they placed this bench the other way around. But um, I guess this way you can admire the mural. Yeah, actually, why not put it around, right? Is the painting old? Is the painting old? <laughs> old, yes. Older than most things in this town. How old exactly, though? I cannot tell you. Oh, wow. Is there a story behind it? Yes, there is. But do you have the time to listen to it? Well, seeing that that seems how I am a second for shit like this. Well, yes, hit me. I do. Hit me up, buddy. Now, legend has it that a long, long time ago, on top of a mountain overlooking four maris, a Solomonar, that's an ancient wizard, was conjuring thunder and rain when, below, a terrifying Balaur, that's a dragon, attacked the town. Oh. The masks, sworn defenders of the town, oh. could not defeat the dragon, but could not live either. So they sent an innocent young shepherd girl by the name of Miwara and her dog, Azor to beg for the Solomonar's assistance. Miwara and Azor's journey up the mountain was not without peril. See, the Solomonar had laid many traps and cunning magical obstacles to stop anyone from disturbing his ritual. 
but Miwara and Azor were smart and agile and resilient, so they made it to the mountain top and told of the dragon's attack. What? But the Solomonar was red with anger and could not see beyond the fact that a girl and her dog had conquered his defenses. Oh. And since they had proven to be smart and agile and resilient, he transformed Miwara and Azor into a black and a white cat. Oh, damn! Forever cursed to roam the hills and mountains without ever resting again. Shit, bro! Then he did make his way down to Forum Maris and found it in smoldering ruins, and the masks all but defeated, making their last stand against the beast. He fought the dragon for three days and three nights, and finally crushed it down into the mountain, burying it in the bowels of the earth. Afterwards, he cried tears of remorse for foolishly cursing the shepherd girl and her dog, and erected a monastery in their remembrance. Oh, wow. That castle above the town that everyone fears its steeple is all that remains of the monastery the Solomonar built ages and ages ago. It became corrupted, and some folks say that it's from the evil that the remains of the dragon still hold. I hear the masks are once again guarding the castle now that its rightful heir has returned. But who would risk going all the way there to see if it's true? Oh, that's where Not we're going? Dear. Not many. Oh, shit. Wow, that was fascinating. I'm glad to hear you say that, young man. I'm still here to tell the story, but for how long? No one really knows or cares about it other than me and the masks themselves. Maybe once I'm gone, so it shall disappear into oblivion. Let's hope not. Wow, okay. Coolio, bro. Coolio. I'll be off now. Have a nice evening. You too, young man. Goodbye. So nice. That is so nice. Gorgeous pastures. My word, that's... that's gorgeous. This is my homeland, kid, eh? She doesn't care. Yep, she doesn't give a fool. Breathtaking. But uh, can we go? She's not going any. Can we go over there? I mean, you can go now, right? So, uh, say, I can't go, 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 go now, right? Okay, so. This is a very Romanian music we are listening, eh? Quite Romanian these okay, so can I give her the slingshot, the helmet or shit? Yo bitch could take this. this. <laughs> He's still to Luric and redundantly so. Uh, I know. <laughs> I know. Cons consensus critic. <laughs> I have this Y shaped thing. Ah yes. But pray, what's in a letter? If you prick it, does it not bleed? If you tickle it, does it not laugh? Uh, I would be very surprised if it did. Our doubts are traitors and make us lose the good we oft might win by fearing to attempt. True, bro! True! That is actually true, bro! Well, she said something correct there. I, I, I have to admit, eh? Nah. Hey, kid, do you go on the helmet, bro? Eric? No. no. Kitty, do you want a helmet, bro? Uh, maybe not. It would be a. Okay, well, fuck that. Uh, can I throw the helmet on the window? <laughs> I'm not a vandal. I don't <laughs> think I am. Pussy! Okay, let's go. Hello! Hello! Let's get with a cat! Hey there, guy with a cat. That's all done. It's a right. girl with a cat on a leash. Very nice. Very nice. Hello. 
Hello, little girl. Hi. Hey. My name's Buzz, and this is my cat, Kitty. Kitty. Nice to meet you. I'm Maria, and this is <laughs> the fuck? What in the name of all that is sacred and holy? <gasps> the kitty can't talk! Yeah, no. Yes, she can. For some reason, people don't usually notice. Oh. My. God. <laughs> is she magical? As magical as they come. True! Cool. Cool. That's a unique looking doggy. That's a unique looking doggy. He's not a doggy, silly. Can't you see he's a kitty cat? We're really stretching the definition here. But how come he barks? Well, he was raised by a doggy. Duh. His adoptive mommy was a Carpathian sheepdog. Oh. Oh, nice. An actual son of a. Well, that's a very cool <laughs> and unique story. So his name is uh, Kiskis. Uh huh. That's how you get his attention. I want to name him something else, but I haven't come up with anything better yet. I understand. Ah, she's, she's, so, she's so cute, though. I am now the second most embarrassed cat around. True. What are you up to, Maria? What are you up to, Maria? Oh, just walking. <laughs> he gets real <laughs> antsy if I don't walk him at least twice a day. Damn. He likes that, huh? <laughs> yeah. He's the happiest kitty when he's in nature. I'd love to take him on a walk in the hills or in the mountains, but mom and dad won't let me. It's too far away. I see. <laughs> yeah, but it'd be safe, little girl. Such a little girl. Did you happen to see a black, a black girl around? What? Did you happen to see a black girl around? Who the fuck? <laughs> what, what? Did you happen to see a black? No. I would have remembered that. Almost everyone around here is basically white. It's so boring. Well, it hasn't been sunny in a while either, has it? No, and weather's been crazy lately. Thunderstorms out of the blue. That's why I can't walk in the hills anymore. Uh-huh. <laughs> A black girl around. Why would we want to see... Wait, what? Wait. Peace is not black though. Why we want to see black girl? Well, I don't understand. I'm a tourist. I'm a tourist. What can you tell me about Forumaris? Well, everyone says nothing ever happens here. So... God, I hope that's true. Okay, well... Catch you later, Maria. See you! Bye, Maria! Okay, can we show, show her any items? That, do you want to help Maria? None of them need noggin protection. No. Do you want the why, Maria? She doesn't need this. No. Do you want the fuck, Maria? She doesn't need the. Do you want the garbage, what Maria? What's wrong with me today? <laughs> Just stop it, boss. <laughs> so retarded, bro. Do you want the bus, you can, Maria? She doesn't need it. Do you want the Necronomicon, Maria? What no. is wrong with me today? Just. Stop. Okay. Alright. <laughs> this is so retarded, bro. Yo, you lazy you want in need of any headgear. Seriously, yeah, without head, no shit doesn't need any <laughs> Holy fuck. Do you want any trash or lady? Oh, yeah, cause that wouldn't ruin everything. <laughs> I found this trash. Do you want it? Yo, do you want a fork? I'm having the weirdest thoughts lately. I know, right? Holy shit. I mean, it's not even a uh, nice fork. It's all bendy and shit. City horn. Oh, what the fuck is wrong with me anyway? <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with me? Okay, red gate. Wait, so I have to find the... Uh, what, what the fuck did he say? I have to find the weird thingy majiki and then... Burn it and shit? Wait, where, where are you going, bro? Do you want this? He doesn't need it. Do you want the garbage? <laughs> Not a great way to make a first impression, boss. What's fair? Oh my god. What's the first impression? We already talked to you, you little shit. Oh my god, bro. I don't know why it's, it's so fine to me. I have no idea. What the shit? Okay, well. 